Today we're talking about how to fix a barometer. Now, very few people will probably actually have the bravery to work on a barometer, but if you are one of those people, here are a couple of things to keep in mind. There are basically four different types of barometers, three that are used most often. One is a water barometer, which is essentially a jar with an open spout, and in that jar is water. And as the air pressure outside changes, the water level in that spout will go up or down. That's responding to the change in the air pressure. That's a very simple device. Generally, if it breaks, you're done with it because the glass vial is broken. There's another kind of barometer called a mercury barometer. That's what most professionals use, and essentially what that is, there's a vial of mercury, and in the middle of that vial is a three-foot tube. Inside the three-foot tube, one end is closed, the other end at the bottom is open. So when you take that tube and you turn it upside down, the mercury in the tube meets the mercury in the vial, and it will equalize the pressure. Now, as the air pressure changes, the more that the air pressure pushes down on that open vial of mercury, that pushes down on the vial outside, which makes the mercury on the inside of the vial go up. Now, if a mercury barometer breaks, don't mess with it because mercury is toxic. Now, some people will also have a digital barometer that measures air pressure based on electrical differences in the air. But most people won't uh, bother fixing those either. You'll have to have a technician look at that. But there is a barometer that is most commonly used in amateur homes, and that would be in the homes of most of us. That's called an aneroid barometer. And the basis of the aneroid barometer is either a little capsule or a little metal box. The metal is actually a combination of beryllium and copper. And when the air pressure changes, that changes the shape of the box or the capsule, and that changes the reading on your barometer. If your barometer has broken, most likely that, that little aneroid capsule or that aneroid box needs to be replaced, and what you simply have to do is remove that from the back of the barometer, get a new unit, and install that in.